In this video, I'll show you how to download a playlist from Mood Mixes and put it into iTunes, where it can also sync with your iPod. The reason to do this is so that you have music that you can listen to from your computer or from your iPod, even when you're disconnected from the internet. Let's get started. The first thing I need you to do is to go to the Mood Mixes website, go to the music section, and then click either your playlists or our playlists, depending on what you'd like to download. In this video, we're going to go to our playlists and then choose the funky rock choice. Great. Now I'd like you to scroll to the bottom of the song list where you'll find a double click to download this playlist choice. Go ahead and do that. On this page, you can choose to download the playlist in whatever format you'd like. In most cases, I recommend you just leave it in the MP3 format. The one common exception is if you'd like to burn CDs of the files on this playlist, in which case you might want to choose the WAV file format. However, here we're just going to download MP3s, so go ahead and click the download button now. Moodmixes is now processing the songs to make a zip file for you. Once this is done, you can download the entire package all at once, where we'll be able to later drop it into iTunes. Great! Now your zip file is ready for you to download, so let's go ahead and do that. Click the Download Your Music button. Great! Your file has downloaded now, and you can unzip it onto your desktop. On Chrome, all you need to do is click on the download and it'll unzip. If you're running Windows, it's much the same thing. You need to find the download, double click it, and then hit the Extract button. Here we'll see the files that have been extracted, and you can see there's a whole lot of songs. What you need to do is move iTunes onto the screen in such a way that the files are also visible. Click on the first song, scroll to the bottom, hold the shift button down, and click on the last song. Now I click, hold, and drag, and drop all the songs here where it says Library. You know you're doing it right when a blue outline appears in iTunes. When you let go, you can now switch to iTunes and see that iTunes has downloaded all the music into itself and they're all ready to play here. Here are the various albums and here are the various genres and artists. If you already know how to sync your iPod with iTunes, you can stop here. However, if you don't know how to do that, I'm going to show you how. Go ahead and choose your iPod name under Devices. Check the Music tab and make sure the Sync Music choice is enabled. Also make sure that Entire Music Library is also enabled. Once those are all done, go ahead and hit the Sync button. You can see that all 50 songs that we just downloaded are going into my iPod. That's all there is to it. 